Hey cycling fans, Joe Jackson here with a quick demonstration on how to install a variety of JJBP fork conversion kits. First thing you'll want to do is figure out how the, your current fork holds its threaded insert in place. This will either be through a small set screw on the bottom of the fork end or possibly a screw installed from the outside of the fork as would be the case with a variety of focus forks. There are several forks on the market which don't use anything to hold those inserts in place. So once that insert's removed, you'll want to take the insert from your JJBP kit. If your insert has an O-ring on it, add a little bit of grease and push it down in place of the old one. If you have a set screw or a screw from the outside, you'll want to retorque those screws to hold your insert. At that point, you're going to take the through hole insert, again, a small O-ring on it, add a little bit of grease, and push that down inside the other fork end. This one's counterboard, so it's going to actually sit a bit sub-flush. At that point, you're ready to install your wheel. Get that set between your fork ends. Your new through axle will come an appropriate length. Don't forget to grease the threads. Through axle torque is 9 to 13 newton meters using a 5 millimeter hex K. Your through axle may come with a thin washer here, that's to uh, adjust the fork threads. Once that through axle is installed, you can check on the other end. If the threads come right up to the end of the insert, you're all set. If they're falling a little bit short, you can remove that washer. At that point, you're ready to ride. Let me know if you have any questions.